Here we are. Dick Tusky again. Tech tips. Very short one this time. Just two little points. We've all been in that situation where we've been unmuted, unmuted when we shouldn't be, and all that. All to do with the mute, unmute. Well, if you're Toastmaster, or if you're in charge, say you're hosting, if you're in charge of the whole Zoom meeting, just make yourself a little card like that, yeah? And when somebody hasn't unmuted themselves, then all you do is just stick it up to the camera like that. Very simple, and it works with a vengeance. And then the other thing is, we all make the mistake of being muted when we should be <laughs> making a speech. All computers have got the facility on them. And it's a spacebar facility. You've often heard people talk about it, probably didn't understand it. But all it is is this. On Zoom, the last action you did will be memorized by Zoom. And say it's to mute yourself or unmute yourself. The spacebar will remember that. So if you want to unmute yourself, spacebar. Mute yourself, spacebar again. And it's very good if you're a Toastmaster or that and you've got a laptop in front of you, which is the preferred means of doing Zoom. So, you just quietly mute and unmute yourself. Nobody knows it. And it's absolutely perfect. But remember that the spacebar will remember an action the last action you did. So make sure it's the mute or unmute. Don't go on to the chat and don't go on to record or don't go on to all the silly stuff, virtual backgrounds that you can do. Just make sure that it's mute that you did the last one. So there's two good tricks. And while you're at it, why don't you make some other cards up like that? Now, there's a good one. And there's another good one. And if you think that I look good, you can do that. <laughs> or if I make a, a nice, nice remark, it's good. So there you are. Two good tips. Deck Tusky. See you next time.